for Ozzy, who's a Manchester United fan. Ozzy, good evening. Hello, Jamie. How you doing, mate? Yeah, we're good. We're good. Uh, big night uh, in the end. Yeah, listen, I was always confident we were going to get the win. Um, I thought we were by far the better team um, on paper, but they're such a good attacking side. You you know, they don't reach a lot of stages of Champions League unless you're really managed well and, and you know, they're really, really tough side to play. However, um, we saw how good the manager Ole was because going in to half time, he needed to motivate those players. Um, I was only in when we were 2-0 down. I was only in when we were 1-0 down. I was only in when we were 3-2 up because... You've got to give managers chances. You can't just go Oli out all the time. And I, and I see a lot of fans out there, they just love joining the bandwagon. Can I just say, when, when Oli out trends on Twitter, it doesn't mean that United fans are making it trend. It means opposition fans are also tweeting out as a bit of banter. So I don't want any people coming out here and saying, oh, well, he's, United fans don't want him. No, United fans love Oli. We want him as the manager. I'm pretty sure it's like a 50-50 split or 60-40 in terms of... Well, then, well, then, no, well then you just contradicted yourself, Ozzy. You said everyone... What, what, what are you talking about, how Jacob? Can, how, can you, how, how can you be a manager? You've just contradicted yourself. You've gone right, from tell saying... Tell me how I did. Tell me how I did. Well, you, well you've just said you love him, you want him out. Half time, you wanted him out, you said. No, I didn't. No, 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 no. I said I was only in... You just said it was only out. No, I said I was only in... At two nil down, and I was also Oli in at three two because I'm always back in the manager. You can't just go and, and attack a, a manager um, when the players are unmotivated. I, I feel like it's the players' fault. When I honestly feel some of the players that we have can't even get into the relegation side. The likes of Fred, we should never have in midfield. Let's be honest about that. Fred, Fred is not a Man United player. Aruan Bissaka is a great is a great defensive player, but he's not a good attacking player. But you have the likes of Ronaldo, you have the likes of Paul Pogba, Bruno Fernandes, who continuously saves this team and continuously save the likes of Bissaka, the likes mm. of Lindelof that shouldn't be in the side. I am only in, and anyone that comes in here and says, "Oh, Ole out, Ole out," they are not a real United fan. But, and I bet but Ozzy, Ozzy, that's, that's but rubbish. That, that's Ozzy, rubbish. don't you have to raise the question though of the fact that you, yes, you, you've got an unbelievable squad of players. The players that he brought on, you know, he brought yeah. on Pogba, Cavani. Sancho, these players will win you games because exactly. be, because they're world class. But you can't. Yeah. It's it still seems very much desperation. It's always uh, trying okay. to dig themselves out of a hole. Can I just tell you? First of all, I just heard I just heard Jason say rubbish. Uh, are, are you the same supporter of a team that that manages to to fire a manager every five games? I'm sorry, but you can't come on here and 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 stick it on me for for backing my manager because I'm a true. Fan. No, no, I'm a, I'm a no, loyal no. fan, unlike you. No, no, but you said, no, what you said, what you said was, what you said was, was that if anyone comes on here and says Oli out, they're not a Man yeah. United fan. And I said no, that's true. rubbish. No, that's it's rubbish. True. No, it's true. Uh, so no, that, I tell you so why. Because they. I tell you why it's true. I, I'll explain myself because it, it does seem a bit, you know, aggressive for me to say that. <laughs> However, you can't just go. We haven't even finished half of the season yet, and they want Oli out. You, you, you need. But they have an opinion. The their squad. opinion. There are plenty of Man United fans, and we've spoken to them. Their opinion yeah. matters just as much as yours. Absolutely, absolutely. But I'm trying to say. Well, then you can't say logical, they're not United fans. Then it's you not, can't. It's not, you it's can't. Not, listen, it's not a logical uh, opinion because you can't go. No, no, you can't. Listen, let me talk because this, you, you have. No, you've right, spoken right. enough, Ozzy. You've spoken enough. No, no, I've, I what I've said. I no, you have. No, you have. You've not let me speak, and I'm telling you now. You've just said. You've just said that any Man United fan that phones up that says Oli out is not a Man United fan. According to you, that's what you've just said, no, right? No, no, no. Yeah, it's not no, logical you're putting, now. You're putting words in my mouth because I, just because I'm a loyal fan and because I stick with a manager through thin and thick and thin, he's a United legend and he's and he's learning to become a top class manager. And he just motivated a bunch of world class players like Ronaldo, who they said he's got an issue with him, but he hasn't because clearly Ronaldo just got the winner and he screamed after the after the, the final whistle and he shook Oli's hand. This is the media trying to trying to create some kind of bubble to get rid of Oli. He's done nothing wrong. He's done absolutely nothing wrong. I think nothing it's very dangerous. I think it's okay. very dangerous for other fans to come on. Yeah. Okay, all right. Ozzy, thanks for your call. Let's go to Vinny. Vinny, good evening. Hi, good evening. Can, can you guys hear me? Yeah, we've got you. Yeah, um, definitely all the out. Because the, the thing about all the is, he gets results when the back's against the wall. Um, he builds the team up again. We go through a good run. Then it, and, then the, the, and then we go bad again. And then we just keep repeating the same loop. But we don't win any trophies. So we know we get good results, the team does well, we get bad results, then the team does well again. But just we just don't win any trophies at the end of it. Mm. Yeah, no, I have to you're agree. Not a pro- you're not a proper fan, apparently. To Ozzy, you're not a fan. Not. Who says I'm not a proper fan? 
Aussie. Yeah, I'm still here, yeah. Why, why am I not a proper fan? I'm just because saying, Aussie, the, I'm just Aussie, saying, all you Aussie, have to do is back the manager. That's all you have to do. Yeah, you don't have to go, to, but turn but on him. You don't have to. You don't have why to. Are you, why are you turning on the manager? We haven't even finished. It's not, we're not even halfway past the season yet. And you're turning on the I manager. Think as, fans, as fans, we have the right to disagree with anything that concerns our club, with, with the player's attitude or with the manager's incompetent. Because it's not just this season, mate. Three seasons yeah. that we've had him. Well, when, when, we, when, listen, when we listen. We we had we had one of the most successful managers of all time, and you go down as the best manager of all time. He had a rough patch, and Oli's allowed to have a rough patch. For you to have well, success, well, how, you've got to build it. How long did Fergie's rough patch last? You've got to build it. I'm I'm giving him one last season. I I believe he's still got it in him to get the best out of players. But we need to get a proper midfield, and you should know that out of everyone. Because if you're a Knights fan, you know that our midfield's not good enough. Benny. I think, oh, mate, to, to be honest no, with you... No, Jamie, Jamie... Hold on, he's, he's got, hold on Ozzy, Ozzy, let me speak. Hold on, go on, Vinny. You know what? I think, I think uh, Jurgen Klopp, when, when, when he first uh, got into Liverpool, and you, you compare Jurgen Klopp's midfield with, with our current midfield now, I would say, as a squad, man-to-man, we've got a better squad than Liverpool. I think attacking-wise, especially... And to say that because we're missing one player in the midfield is the reason Wally hasn't given us any trophies. Mm-hmm. I, think, I, I think that's ridiculous. Look at our defense. Varane, Maguire, Shaw. Look at our attack. Ronaldo, Sancho. We've got Fernandez, Rashford, Greenwood, yep. uh, Cavani. And to say because we're lacking in midfield, that, that's why Ole should get the backing. I think that's, that's absurd. I agree with you, Vinny. I agree with you. I, I think it, the reason that Manchester United ain't won trophies is tactically when it comes to the crunch, they yeah. get it. They get it wrong. That I mean, in, in the Europa League final, yeah, in 120 minutes, we made one substitution, and you know who came on? Fred. Mm-hmm. In yeah. 120 minutes, Fred came on. Yeah, no, I agree. All right, Vinny, thanks for your call. Keep them coming in, uh, Aussie as well. Thanks for your call. Keep them coming in. Oh three seven one seven double two double three double four.